biology facts about human body. Sex is one of the best stress busters, it lowers your blood pressure and calms you down. Having sex at least three times a week can make you look four to seven years younger. At the time of your orgasm, an average person's heart beats at the rate of 140 beats per minute. Sex is a great all-natural cure for headaches. Research has shown that sperm can travel up to 7 inches in an hour. On average, you burn 100 calories in a single sex session. If you're sexually attracted to someone, it is much more difficult to lie to them. A woman's sexual drive reaches its peak just before her period. A woman's breast can swell up to 25% when she's turned on. You only need all the sperm that could fit into an aspirin capsule to repopulate the earth. Psychology says your inner nose swells while having sex. The average male orgasm lasts for 6 seconds, whereas an average female orgasm lasts 20 seconds. Psychology says sex is 10 times more effective than Valium. The average vagina is 3 to 4 inches long but can expand by 200% when sexually aroused. Shaving your pubic area increases your chances of spreading an STI. One orgasm a day may decrease a man's risk of prostate cancer. A study found that good sex triggers the region of the brain associated with falling in love. Men who have sex at least twice a week can almost have the risk of heart disease, according to a 2010 study. The average man has 11 erections per day and 9 erections at night. Women who have sex at least once a week have more regular menstrual cycles. The fear of having, seeing, or thinking about an erection is called ithophalophobia. Men reach their sexual peak at 17 years of age. Married people masturbate far more than people living alone. Most women prefer a dark place over a well-lit place to have sex. Psychology says a woman can reach orgasm in about 4 minutes through masturbation but it'll take her 10 to 20 minutes to orgasm during intercourse. A man ejaculates approximately 17 liters of semen in his entire life, that contains about half a trillion sperm. In research, only required about 2 tablespoons of blood are required to get an erect penis. A woman's clitoris contains over 8,000 nerve fibers, almost twice that of a penis. Have you ever wondered why it's difficult to urinate immediately after having sex? That's because when you orgasm, an antidiuretic hormone is released in your body. A study found that peeing after having sex helps prevent you from catching urinary tract infections. An average healthy man can ejaculate enough sperm in two weeks to impregnate every woman in the world. Ejaculated sperm survives only for a few hours outside the body but once it enters a woman's vagina and makes its way up to her cervical mucus it can live for up to three to five days. Sex increases your immunity to pain. Orgasms trigger hormones that help you increase your pain threshold. Only 18% of women orgasm on vaginal penetration alone while having sex with a partner. People who are into kinkier sex may be psychologically healthier. Sleep-deprived men are more likely to believe women want to have sex with them. This is not a joke. A study found that men feel more emotional pain after a breakup than women do. Psychology says we automatically perceive people who smell good as more attractive. Ginger stimulates the feelings of excitement associated with sex. Eating ginger elevates your heart rate, gets your blood flowing, and gets you excited for the night ahead. Psychology says women suffering from migraines have a higher sex drive. Post-workout is a great time to have sex. Working out releases testosterone in your body and also circulates blood into your genital area. The testes increase in size by 50% when a man is aroused. Some people orgasm while working out due to repetitious core movement. Living alone could increase the risk of depression by up to 42% according to recent research. And guys if you enjoyed this video, hit the like button and make sure to subscribe. And also check out our other videos as well. Until next time, stay safe and awesome. Thank you for watching.